But you see, all these seasons, all these distresses, they don't leave us unscathed. We're going to have wounds. We're going to have scars. We are going to walk with a limp in a sense. In Genesis 32, um, scripture tells of the story between Jacob and the Lord where Jacob wrestled with God. Can you imagine like really wrestling with the Lord in, in human form? And um, Jacob didn't relent. He, he strove with God and it, he put his hands on him and said, I will not let you go until you bless me. And the Lord blessed him, but he blessed him in a really unexpected way. He blessed him by touching his hip, the sinew of um, his thigh, I believe it says, and it left him with a limp. And that limp was a gift. It was a blessing. And normally, you know, if we have a scar or we have a limp or something that maybe we want to hide, um, we don't think of that as a blessing or a gift, but really what it's doing is it's acting as a reminder of something that we've gone through and something that we have been healed from. And we, maybe we walk with a limp and maybe we're not completely healed in the way that we thought we would, but we have known God to be faithful in each of those distresses, whether it was the desert, um, chains, folly, or the storm, we can look back and see God was with me there. And I might have a limp, and I might have a scar, and I might be a little bit um, shaken. He met me there, and He delivered me. 